Well, there's a new mobile science lab stopping by several Marion County schools this week teaching young students about STEM. And it's being done in a unique cube container. Matthew Foltz cannot be contained. He's live this morning with some students and what they can expect later today. Good morning, Matthew. <laughs> Hey, Carlos and Karen, that's right. I cannot be contained. I'm outside of this container. But hey, what better way to start off this school year with than a one of a kind mobile science lab that's built in this unique shipping container popping up at your school? Well, that's what's going to happen for several schools right here in Marion County. With the, and it's a goal of getting students here in our area prepared for a potential science career post grade school. Now it's called the Curiosity Cube and it's a part of Millie Poor Sigma's hands-on science tour. Taking science on the road to schools with fewer resources for hands-on STEM learning, which stands for science, technology, engineering, and math. Now this year students will get to learn the importance things that comes to with the human bi bi microbiome, excuse me, that local scientists will be teaching them as well as how they function and differ from each person all while getting this hands-on experience. So we have three different experiments inside. Um, at one, they'll learn uh, what their microbiome looks like and how everybody's microbiome is as unique as your fingerprint. Uh, at the other stations, you get to use microscopes to see the different types of bacteria that make up our microbiome. And then we also talk about the different types of decisions that you make each day and how that might affect your microbiome. Now the Curiosity Cube will only be sticking around for two days here in Marion County as they'll be uh, giving uh, elementary schoolers as well as middle schoolers that hands-on experience. Then the Cube will be taking off to head to Cleveland next week. And I want to mention that the uh, experts with this tell me that each year it's something different. So the microbiomes won't be learned next year for future students. And this is the first time that the Cube has actually been on tour for the first time since the pandemic has begun two years ago. So everyone's pretty excited for this, students and those are who are heading it, guys.